the school nurse also has several primary activities. Uh, one is direct care to students in emergency situations, and that's that's pretty self-explanatory. That's you know, if a student has a scratches, bruises, bumps, uh, if she breaks her leg, if they um, have some kind of emergency situation, the nurse would assess and decide, is this something that I can handle here with some first aid, or do I need to, you know, call 911? Do they need to attend uh, to see an emergency physician at the hospital? Or do they need um, to also call the parents? So she would be in charge of those types of things. Um, she's also in charge of managing chronic conditions. Um, she's a collaboration of care. Children with diabetes or asthma, maybe ADHD, these types of diseases, she would make sure that they are getting their medications on time. She would also be the one to, um, to give the child the medications. They would go to her office to receive medications. Um, she would also make sure that the family and the child were educated on you know, diet that would help in the case of a diabetic child. Uh, if the family's into holistic uh, natural care, she would also help with those types of things as well. Just a well-rounded collaboration of care for those chronic conditions. Um, she also works on health education and promotion. Um, things like uh, for students and teachers, families in the community, she's going to teach classes, maybe just uh, some you know one-on-one -on -one education just to make sure that those, those needs are met um, in the community and families and students and teachers. She's going to assess and provide screenings and referrals for health conditions. That might include a child that she suspects or the teacher suspects might have ADHD. Uh, she would provide referrals for the family to see a physician to confirm those suspicions. She might also provide some of the testing initially to make sure that referral was necessary. Um, she's also going to do things um, like for a dyslexic child uh, for learning disabilities. She may help assess for that and then contact the family and provide referrals. Also, things as simple as uh, eyes, checking, doing like a complete eye check for the uh, students for vision, um, also hearing. So uh, that might be a school-wide basis or even a community basis.